Hi, right, it's time for another math easy solution term. Discuss some hyperbolic functions and look at some identities uh, and pr uh, proofs of identities. Uh, basically, in my earlier videos, I went over what hyperbolic functions were, their definition, and also their derivatives. But now I'm going to go over a video series going over some useful identities. And the f first two I'm going to go over are these ones right here, where hyperbolic sine of negative x equals to, well, negative hyperbolic sine of x. But for cos, the negative x inside doesn't affect. It's going to be the same thing as if there was no negative x. So uh, the proof of this one's quite simple. Well, let's go over the first one first. Uh, well, we know that uh, hyperbolic sine of, of uh, x is just equal, equal to, by definition, e to the x minus negative e to the, I mean e to the negative uh, x divided by two. So this is by definition. So if we just plug in the negative uh, x here, this, the proof of this is pretty easy. So we just plug this in, we'll get e to the negative x minus e to the well negative negative x divided by two, well this is becomes well e to the, yeah, e to the negative x uh, minus e to the plus x or yeah, or just leave it x there. So now we could, so now there's a negative here. If we take the negative out, we will be equal to negative e to the uh, x right here. This will be positive. This will be negative now minus e to the negative x all divided by two. And this is basically this function right here. So this equals to negative uh, cinch or hyperbolic sine of x. So there is our proof. So we'll just check this off as proof. So now the second one, this cos h of negative x. Well, it's uh, we know that cos h of x is equals to e to the x plus e to the negative x. It's the same thing as sine, except there's a plus divided by two. So now the proof. Again, we just plug this in negative x right here equals to e to the negative x plus e to the negative uh, negative x that just becomes well x divided by 2 and this plus this is the exact same thing you can just move these around just make it look like exact same thing e to negative x over 2 and this equals 2 cos h of x and it's the exact same thing. So there is our proof for that. I'll just check it here. Anyways, that's all for today. Hope you learned from this uh, quick little video. And uh, if you want to learn more about hyperbolic functions, make sure to watch uh, uh, related videos in the video links below. And uh, remember, you could also download these exact notes in the Dropbox link below. And thanks for watching. And stay tuned for another math easy solution.